Hi, in this video I'm going to very briefly cover the export options because I'm still working on some of these, so uh, there, there are some options that are, are coming along the line. Um, what we have at the moment is if you look at the little rocket export button down at the bottom, uh, this gives you this page here which has four options at the moment, well five if you count the download project file, but four options that will get your text out in a readable manner. You can export it as an HTML document by simply clicking that button or, or as a markdown option object, uh, a markdown, markdown document, which uh, again is another web format very useful for writing out your writing your book out to say a blog posting. It might be useful if you use markdown as part of your content management system. Uh, I'm currently working on the RTF version, which is going to be an export to doc version. You can, of course, export to HTML and import that, open that with Word uh, if you want to as well. That's another way of doing it. Uh, and it's relatively straightforward from the look of things that when you're working with Markdown and HTML to export to ebook format. The ebook might uh, have to ask you a couple of questions like to uh, upload an image to go as part of the, the process or whatever, but that's something I'm working on and hoping to get built soon. You can also download the individual project file. Uh, say you want to share one project with someone rather than your whole database using the database saving tool. You can download the project file and send that over to them and they can upload it and using the import project tool at their end. Now, WaveMaker is free software, and I hope you enjoy using it. Uh, if you feel like supporting me, please consider becoming a patron on Patreon. Thank you.